So this is my A5 uh, water I mean, buoy. It's for a 60 foot to 70 foot uh, yacht. It's A5. It's not an A3. And I ran a hose to it. And this fortunately has uh, intake. And on the other side, it has another. Um, thing right there that's a air outtake um, I stuck something in here I go to see if it went all the way through and it does go all the way through so I made this adapter I bought this adapter at Home Depot and I attached this little hose to it so I can control it it has a little on off switch here so I can control it fortunately this did not this part here did not attach to the hose so I had to use a uh, washing machine extension so I can connect it together. So hopefully this works out great. And it looks like it's filling pretty good. No leaks. There was a little bit of seepage earlier. But now it's like it's flowing pretty good. Yep, it's starting to fill up. And it's filling up fairly fast. So it looks like I'm able to let it go. Uh, there are a couple of videos online that shows, you know, that this plug, you know, you got to drill a hole through there. Fortunately, I didn't have to. I did bring a drill, and all I did, I measured. I use this part so I don't damage the thread. I use this part for the length of uh, the, the thickness of the drill bit. But fortunately, I didn't have to use that. Uh, this is my setup. I use a bolt, uh, four washers, and these I clamp these hooks right here. I attach two more here with a with with a little um, I forgot what they call this, but they sell them at home. The anchor anchor hook with a swivel hook attached to this, going up to a chain, and that's all metal. So it should be able to support. On both sides, this metal post on both sides of this is welded to. And it looks like it's filling up nicely. And it's holding, so I don't have to hold it in place. I went ahead and I took out that side so air can escape. And then I'll adjust the speed of this. All in all, this filled out nice. It took me a couple of trips to Walmart. I mean, sorry, to Home Depot to get this together. But uh, overall, it worked out good, and I can show you the setup. This is for the A5. This is a the four inch. I used a five inch because I had to hook up all those other stuff to it, and I slid a piece of black pipe over this to create create a bearing situation so the threads don't cut into the into the plastic. So I slid a three quarter inch over this, and this um, is three quarter inch as well. So from from Home Depot, and you know I bought extra one of these as I thought I would need it, but I didn't. And you know, this is the bolt that I use. You also come at Home Depot. It's all in the same section, so it's really easy to put together this thing yourself. Uh, some people say you need to generate your air compressor to blow it up first to create a shape. I didn't have to do that. At least I don't think I had to do that. I may at the end, but I will see. Uh, but I think that's about it. I wish I had a piece of uh, pipe to show, but basically I took so this is this is a, say this is a piece of uh, black pipe. I simply put it over there to create a smooth surface, and it also creates a bearing as well. So it should last longer. And all these things are rated much higher than what this thing will weigh. So hopefully everything works out. So I filled it till water starts squirting out. 
the other side like here I put the screw the thing back in and I fill the other side from the other the same fill it up some more till water starts splitting out of this um, and then I sealed it uh, there was air, a little bit of air to the top but you know overall it's it's, it's full all the way up to about here because water was squeezing out of here um, so I know it's past here so this is where it is um, man it turned out pretty darn good I wiped it down it's a fairly big thing it's 30, 36 inches around well 36 inches across and you know this will help work with the kids as well as the the, the taller heavier punches because you can hit it and it gives a little i mean it's a little out of shape because you know it'll it'll take a shape later on i guess after being used I wiped it down a little bit it came a little dirty but man i'm impressed with it so far I'm gonna hit it a little bit and see how it works. So my overall impression of the A5 buoy um, used as a, a water water bag for punching. Um, I'm really impressed with it. Uh, I will do an update on it in a few months uh, as to how it's working out. Uh, if the shape like comes in more fully because you know it was folded so it has like little little, little wrinkles here and there um, so hopefully that will smooth out over time but overall it was a great project um, now that I have the hardware necessary to do other um, fills like that it should be a lot easier um, if you all have any questions ask it in the comment section down below I'll be glad to answer any questions concerning it uh, and if I don't know the answer well then I'll just tell you I don't know the answer. Y'all have a good day.